This is an RTV6 update working for you. Hey there, I'm Trevor Shirley, and these are your latest headlines from the RTV6 newsroom. Just days ago, it was announced that Indiana's former Republican Congressman Todd Rokita could be joining the board of Amtrak. But now a passenger's rights group is calling on the U.S. Senate to reject Rokita for that job. Last week, President Trump nominated Rokita for a position on the Amtrak Board of Directors, but the Rail Passengers Association says during Rokita's time in Congress, he voted twice to eliminate public funding for Amtrak once in 2015 and again in 2017. If he's confirmed by the Senate, Rokita would sit on the board of the very organization he voted to defund. We have reached out to Rokita for comment, but so far haven't heard back. And funeral services for former Indiana Senator Richard Luger will be held in Indianapolis this week. The Luger Center is asking people who'd like to attend to register on its website. You can find a link to that over on the RTV6 News app. The service starts at 1 o'clock on Wednesday, all of that happening at St. Luke's United Methodist Church. You can also pay your respects at the Indiana State House. That's where Luger will, will lie in state for 24 hours before the funeral. The six-term senator died last month. He was 87 years old. Just a spotty shower chance in our Monday forecast. We are going to keep quite a bit of cloud cover, though, and some cool temperatures. Not as cool as Sunday, though, where temperatures were stuck in the 40s. This time around on Monday, we'll get through the 50s. Some areas getting right to about 60 degrees for that afternoon high. That'll be you in Bloomington and Columbus, 56 in Peru and 59 in downtown. Really getting back into the sunshine on Tuesday, and that's where temperatures really start to take off here as we get back into the middle 60s. Seven day planning forecast next best chance of rain comes our way on Wednesday and then again Thursday night. But look at the temperatures. We'll start to see those numbers approaching 80 degrees for highs next weekend. Kyle, thanks for more weather and stories you need to know. Be sure to download the RTV6 mobile app. Thanks for joining us.